Repair Clinic encourages you to perform this procedure safely. In this video, we will show one or more of these icons to alert you when to use caution. Before you replace the fuel line on your string trimmer, first make sure the engine has cooled and that there is little or no fuel left in the tank. Next, remove the wire and boot from the spark plug to prevent the engine from accidentally starting. Note the orientation of the fuel lines attached to the primer assembly. Then disconnect them. Be prepared for some fuel to spill out. Now release the check valve and vent tube. Remove the mounting screws securing the fuel tank and pull off the tank. Now pull out the fuel line assembly from the tank. Slide off the filter retaining ring and pull the fuel filter out of the old fuel line. Pull the old fuel line out of the grommet. Install the new fuel line by sliding it into place on the grommet. Now slide the retaining ring onto the new fuel line and insert the existing fuel filter or install a new one. Secure it with the retaining ring. Apply some liquid dish soap or rinse aid to the grommet. Now insert the fuel filter into the tank and snap the grommet into place. Reposition the tank on the engine housing and replace the mounting screws to secure. Reposition the check valve in the slot in the starter housing. Reconnect the fuel lines to the appropriate ports on the primer assembly. It's important to keep the lines properly oriented. Reattach the wire and boot to the spark plug. Add fuel to the tank and your string trimmer should be ready for use.